Okay guys, so I've been like my birthday, my birthday, my birthday all month long. And finally, it has came and gone. I'm officially 35 years old. Yesterday, September 18th was my birthday. Yes, Virgo season, I am a Virgo. And I kind of just, I had these expectations that I wanted to do the most, but then of course on my birthday, the Virgo and me came out and I just really wanted to just retreat and like relax and rest and be calm. So I'm gonna turn up this weekend, but for today, it was super important that I went to the DMV to renew my license. So this is a little for my driver's license for the next what four years before I have to renew again this one comes courtesy of Arabella hair so if you ever find my ID hair courtesy of Arabella hair I'm gonna go ahead and jump into the tutorial be gracious give me grace I filmed it at like 8 a.m. this morning my appointment was at 9 a.m. and I think I started filming at like 8 30 so I had literally like 15 minutes to like do my hair get out the door and then get there so anyways I'm gonna go ahead and jump into the tutorial be sure to check this one out direct link in the description box and without further ado let's go ahead and get right into it jumping right into it this is the star of the show we're going with a 5x5 deep wave hd lace closure wig here is a look at the inside construction of the cap it does have the attachments for a elastic band or an adjustable elastic band um and they did include that as well as combs that you can sew into the wig i'll show you that little goodie bag at the end of the video this one was set as a center part it is 5x5 closure wig so i'm gonna just go ahead and extend that parting as much as I can it's definitely giving five by five for sure and I love that first step here is going to be to do the dynamic duo you guys know I have been on a journey to stop doing the dynamic duo with my wet wigs and I'm gonna wear it in a wetter hairstyle or like wet it down I'm trying not to do this step but I just literally reverted back to what I knew because I was in a rush um I got back home at about 8 30 from dropping the kids off at school and I had to be at my DMV appointment to uh take my driver's license picture at 9 p.m and the office was about 10 minutes from my house so calculating i had like 10 minutes to get ready um before i had to like get to the car and grab my coffee and all of that so that's why i was in a rush and kind of just working with what i had i did go ahead and spray the wig down with a glueless adhesive i love the way they covered the ribbon with a piece of hair so that it definitely gives frontal vibes as you guys can see i am pulling forward some baby hair and i'm just securing it generously with a good amount of edge control i'm going to trim this down and swoop the baby hair to my liking and if it looks cakey understand that i did go ahead and apply a glueless adhesive typically i work in steps where I would apply the adhesive and allow it to dry before moving on but because this one sit on my head so perfectly and gluelessly I was able to like allow it to like air dry if that if that makes any sense while I worked on other steps because I was pressed for time so in result it's gonna look cakey especially this step where I'm adding the foundation powder but literally just trust the process you've seen the pictures you've seen the intro and you'll see in just a moment once I melt it down it's gonna come together perfectly but adding um, edge control as well as this um, foundation powder on top of like wet hairspray just looks a hot mess so if you've ever been in the situation and I've seen a lot of ladies uh, around Town or online where their wigs look like this at, as the end result you'll see how I kind of bring it together and melt it off so that it looks flawless and very much like a um, professional salon look also you could go in and tweeze it out and make it a lot more thinner which will be a little bit more natural you're gonna see that once it's dry and set I'm gonna add a little bit more of my um, lace tint along the hairline and it's gonna give more of an illusion of like it being a lot more tweezed for the sake of my pictures but again a glueless wig with 15 minutes to install and style I think I'm doing great on time here I am I just pulled the camera back so you can see the length of the hair as I did mention this is deep wave and I'm just moisturizing it with a little bit of water I'm gonna go in with these staple products that I've been loving so much from OGX this is a cream with a mousse I like to get the hair a little bit wet before I go in and then today I went with the cream first and generously applied it all the way around and then I'm gonna go in with the mousse and I'm also generous with this um, I think I have like one more hairstyle I can do with these two products before I'm completely out. Um, I bought these I want to say maybe two weeks ago and I have been loving this combination so much. Maybe not as much as my Nairobi but maybe close. Maybe it's a close second. I really really love it. And here is a texture shot of what that deep wave hair looks like paired with a little water and moisture and mousse. I think these curls are amazing and I'm so happy I chose this wig for my pictures. My pictures are going to look so good. And I am using the Demon brush to clump the curls. I did notice it was still a little bit more dry on this side on the ends. So I did go in with a little bit more product and I think after this a little bit more water. I was scrunching the hair but honestly you don't have to scrunch this hair. The deep wave is so defined and so beautiful that definitely you don't need to 
scrunch or form the curls so this is what i was talking about and when i said trust the process it looks a little bit cakey along the hairline but once i melted and gave it the opportunity to dry it looks so flawless and salon quality i'm also here there is this little lump right there and i get that often where like at the end of the lace on the i think it's like the right side i always get a lump and i think it's more so because my braids are in cornrows and they are not flat but i love the way this came out for my pictures i did decide to push the hair behind my ears so you can see my full face and then i went ahead and moved these um fendi earrings from the second hole to the first hole because i did pair them with a a pair of hoops check out my shorts i did a video on these you can get all the details and yeah i really love the way this one came out it's 180 percent density five by five lace closure wig she's hd she's pre-plugged and she definitely fits glueless amazing flawless and all the details are in the description box and i think she's 26 inches in length i think i covered everything um yeah she's gorgeous and my pictures i'm sure came out perfect hey, Lebuck, so we are done with this look i did do this one what like 12 hours ago i did it at like eight o'clock this morning i had a dmv employment so i wanted to look nice with fresh hair and this was the one that i chose i think i chose well we will see when my id picture comes back yesterday i turned 35 it was my birthday so today i had to go ahead and renew the license because you know you can't go too long with your license be ex being expired and i was a good girl and i did the whole process last week online but of course you gotta go inside and take your picture anyways this one did come from our bella hair and this is the packaging they always send this beautiful dust bag and this is like a forever bag where you're supposed to keep your wig inside they did give us a couple of stuff so this was actually inside the bag that like the wig was actually in like a little plastic bag and it's like all the goodies to customize your wig you do have the adjustable elastic band in there you also have some combs if you want to like sew those in and then they also gave some wig tape which you guys know I do my units completely glueless so I probably won't use that but it's nice to have especially for like vacation when you're doing water sports that probably would work fantastic also in my package was this dust this little mesh goodie bag and inside you do get your HD wig caps you also get a melt belt and it does say Arabella hair all over it a pack of lashes a baby hair brush I really like this color and then they do give you also this pearl little clip at this point I have a collection of these so I could do like a really cute like hairstyle like an updo and have like a bunch like in the back going all different directions I think that would be super cute as far as the hair goes as I mentioned I was really wanting to do some fresh hair for my photo my picture ID which is gonna stick with me for what like four years in California so I definitely wanted to do something that was gonna be easy I think I started at like 8 15 and I had to be to the DMV by nine which wasn't a lot of time but luckily it was a closure wig with curly hair which you guys already know melt that baby down add a little baby hair if you like tint the lace and then if you have extra time go in and wet it down and add a little bit of products i had time to do all of the above but i did go ahead and go with something that was like um i was gonna say old faithfuls but these are kind of like new earth to my channel but they've been like my favorite combo of the month and these come from ogx and again you guys have seen me use these quite a bit of times and this one is the mousse and it is a decadent creamy mousse it with coconut oil and shea butter and then this one here is the air dry cream you guys have seen me use this by itself use this by itself use them together use this first and then the second and then use this first and use the second um i've kind of used it in different combinations and i really like it the mousse by itself will give you the crunchy hold um which i do like for like longevity with your curls if you're gonna be like trying to make them last all week but if you want like fluffy soft curls like you see today this definitely is a great dynamic duo. You know, dynamic duo is my favorite thing to say, but this is definitely a great dynamic duo. And I picked these up at Target. I can't remember the price point. They probably weren't like cheapy cheapy, but they also weren't like super expensive. So I have those in the description box and they smell fairly good. They're not like, oh my God, but they definitely will have your hair, your hair smelling good. And again, they go ahead and accentuate the wave pattern. But honestly, I could have used anything with this wig because Arabella has some of the best hair, especially when it comes to their wavy textures. And you can also definitely customize like you can go in and thin out the hairline if you would like I definitely didn't have time for that and I didn't mind keeping it as is you guys know when you add a little bit of product like a lace tint it kind of will finesse and just give the illusion that the hairline is a lot thinner than what it is like right now you know that I'm adding this product but if you ask which side is thinner you would normally say this side but you guys will know now that it's just powder it's a great illusion especially for um, like photos and stuff so this is how mine was and I didn't unfortunately have time to do makeup because you 
guys know. I don't think I have makeup on on any of my ID photos, which I guess is the most natural way or the best way to go as far as somebody being able to look at your ID and actually um, identify you. But of course you guys will know you wanna look like a baddie in your photos. In conclusion, this one came out absolutely beautiful. Again, I wish I would have had time to go in and beat my face. Even this top is really cute. Um, it came from a store called Fashion Cute. It's like a quick little store in a local shopping center. And it comes with like the matching like shorts. So it's a cute little set that I didn't wear through the summer. And this is probably the last week I'll be able to wear it before we really, really get into the fall vibes. And of course my eye is watering. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and let you guys go. Be sure to check her out. I do have a direct link in the description box. You guys already know I also have so many videos with Arbella hair. So you'll be able to go to my channel and just type in Arbella hair and you'll find like tons of videos. Thank you guys so much for watching for like the moon time. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Smooches.